All right, guys. So I got this in the mail to try out. It's the new parent uh, Nafi uh, aerial drone. Very compact. Um, on the back here, we've got the descriptions of everything, 4K HDR video, 21 megapixel camera, three axis image stabilization gimbal. I thought this was kind of cool that it actually has a 180 degree tilt up and down. So that seems pretty cool. It kind of gives it an advantage over the Mavic and, and some of the other DJI products and other products out there. Um, it's super compact and portable. The controller seems kind of cool, but estimates 25 minute flight time with a smart battery. Uh, the package contains the drone with one battery, the controller, it says it has 16 gig memory uh, SD card in it, uh, USB-C cable, eight additional propeller blades, and the carrying case. So let's open this thing up and see how it is. It has nice packaging. So we've got the little parrot case here. I guess this has the drone in it. We've got the controller. Seems kind of interesting. We've got the USB-C cable. We've got quick start guide and flight safety guide. And this is the extra propellers. The packaging. All right. Open it up. And there is our drone. So the legs extend out. Seems uh, honestly kind of, I mean, it's, it's a cool compact setup, but it's a bit flimsy, uh, especially after you use like the DJI products. Legs are, I mean, it's definitely not as high quality plastic as some of the other products, but camera seems nice. Uh, it says 21 megapixels, 4K HDR, 2.4 lens. Pretty cool. Uh, the battery. Oh, there we go. There's the battery. The battery pops up, charges there. And oh, it looks like actually the SD card is inside. So you have to remove the battery in order to change the memory. All right, there's the controller. Controller slides up. Looks like when you slide it up, it automatically turns on. So we've got the phone clasp. Looks like it will only hold a phone, it will not hold a tablet, just so you know. Let's see if it'll hold my LG phone. Seems kind of, all right, definitely don't recommend using your phone in its case. All right, there we go. All right, quick, super quick start guide. So there's eight steps shown here. Number one, charge the battery. Looks like it's already got a decent charge. Number two, charge the controller. Three, download the pre-flight or free flight six app. Four, extend this thingy here and put the phone in, which you already did. Number five, plug your phone in using the cable. Hopefully you have a USB-C. Uh, six, open the drone, we already skipped that. Seven, turn on the drone. All right, so to turn on the drone, just a one button. Hit one button there, turns on. We're good to go. Number eight is push this button and it's pushes the, or I guess it puts the uh, drone into flight mode. So we'll do a couple tests and see how it actually flies. Um, like I said, overall, like first impression, like the drone, the gimbal seems pretty good. You, know, you look at, stays with it well. Um, let's see, you know, looks like it's already, it is already connected. So we got the tilt control. I wonder if you can, I hope you can adjust the tilt speed. Not sure what these other buttons do yet. Looks like this is a magnifying, so maybe it oh, zooms in and out. 
Controls left, right, up, down. Got the home button. Up, down, which I don't really want to press that yet until I install the program. All right, so I'm gonna install the app, and we're gonna do a little test flight and see how it does.